Hello everybody, welcome to the second semi-final between Lamar Soleil and his High Elves and Crystal Hunter and his Skaven. In the booth with me is Fymir and Dimmy. Hello! Hello everybody, here we are at the, another semi-final. The other one. <laughs> yep, the other one. <laughs> Yeah, Chugs, Hello. it seems <laughs> Hello It Hello. seems crazy not to defend against the Blitz at all, but there you go, that's what Chunter did. Bailed out. And then maybe maybe what he was thinking was, right, okay, one in twelve times I lose because I don't defend against the Blitz. But eleven times out of twelve I win because I tilt the Marcel by not defending against the Blitz. <laughs> yes, and also he gets a quick snap, which is probably one of the better results with his setup. Yes, yeah, it fixes his terrible setup. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> How bizarre. Um Crystal Hunter cut a armor busted gutter runner and a lineman to get a wizard. Um, Lamar Soleil with 12 players couldn't really afford to cut anything because um, there is a full claw palm with tackle and horns for Chunter and a dirty player. And still a decent bench. So, yeah, this is a weird matchup. I mean, really nice team for Lamar's, but. Yeah, Chugs. And here it comes. Nothing. <laughs> yeah, obviously this was the guy getting blitzed. A million percent. As, yes, as it's, 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 yes, I predicted that one. And uh, I'm really surprised that he didn't follow with a pile on there. Yeah, I mean, it's worth it, right? The problem is if you just straight chasm, then you're left with having to dodge away. But so. He could have protected the ball first before he did it. Yeah. Because I think, yeah, you, that's a play you really want to pile on. Um, you've got a sacker, he's got a show sure hands. You definitely want to get rid of the show sure hands. And uh, there is not a single player on the Masias team he's going to risk doing a foul. Exactly, yeah. Oh, grab doing a thing. Not that much. Not, not really. <laughs> There is a Skyler Lino for La Marseillaise. Yes, that's the, that's the only guy that you could uh, go for the maybe, you know, a foul. Yeah. But it's pointless. Pointless. Foul now. <laughs> oh. Do you know what else is pointless? What? What? The Swarm Lord. Hey! Hey! Oh, we thought we were free of that, but no, here <laughs> no. it comes back. The funniest He's thing ever, isn't it? The best thing ever. I can't wait to go back to Spain and tell my pals about the story, you know, about this uh, <laughs> Irish guy, you know. Uh, you got to find the funniest thing ever. <laughs> oh, he's uh, he's not dacking. No, of course not. He he said he will never dacker because it. To be fair, I don't think wrong. the dacker against Hiles is that great anyway, is it? No, I mean I wouldn't no. dacker either, but I just think it's funny that he's like, you know, you shouldn't be opposed to it. For any, you know, like you shouldn't be morally opposed to it or whatever. I just think it's always terrible. That's just wrong. Are we hitting the leader, or are we hitting the gutter? It's a good question. I mean, your mighty blow tackler is not positioned well to hit the gutter, so I guess you just hit the leader. Defenseless yes, take the well, leader down. I think he's gonna move the leader. Problem is, it's like mm, he can't it's... move him because he's got to protect his killer. He's oh, yeah, true. Back. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's a hundred percent. It's bad, <clears throat> mate. You want to see me try and put socks on, sick as eggs? I am not <laughs> flexible at all. It's a right struggle. <laughs> Maybe if I uh, used a bit more tactics, and, uh, I might put them on a bit easier. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, so, yeah. Dimi, where you the, uh, put your terminators in this situation? Where you put your, your librarian? <laughs> now you are being having space Hulk tactics. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, space Hulk was great, mate. Space Hulk was fun. Smashed it. Mm. I reckon it'd be better. Yeah. Yeah, good, good, it's good fun multiplayer. I've played it multiplayer a few times, like with other people who spent, you know, yeah. fifty pound or whatever for the box and then played about five games in their lives. I've played about five different people one game each. <laughs> I wouldn't mind like yeah, I wouldn't mind playing it over a beer or something, just like if you're bored, you've got nothing else to do. Yeah. Yeah, it's quite fun. Teach the kids to help you. Plastic sock stretcher. Oh, mate, you need to link that, Jack Ball. <laughs> you could really make my life easier. I don't know why the Nas is thinking so much about this. 
He's just probably having a cigarette, isn't he? He's French. Mm. They all smoke. Yeah. Maybe he's adjusting. He's a... Maybe he's maybe he's adjusting the onions around his <laughs> around his neck. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there is only two options for uh, La Marseillaise here. Blitz. Punch the leader, uh, surely we punch the leader. Yeah, Blitz the leader, that's guaranteed, but it's move, uh, move, move the leader, uh, move back, or surround the. Oh, he's going in. He's team. Yeah, he's yeah, going he's in. Going. Up, up, base, base, base. Big balls. Like it's it's all it's honestly okay hitting this. But like obviously you block there, right? You 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 put in the guard and you block this guy, and then you can blitz this tackle. Like bl blitzing the tackle is okay. If you put if you put the guard in, you only got a one D, right? Because that's guard. On no, the no, you put the guard. They put the guard in there. I'm sharing my screen to me. You put the guard in there and punch his guard first, and then you blitz the tackle. Like blitzing the block tackle was okay, but I mean I would I would blitz the leader sure, but I wouldn't hate blitzing the. Uh, I wouldn't have hated blitzing the. Uh, Tackle. The tackler, yes, getting a tackler uh, out He's of the... He's got to do something to protect that strength for catcher, surely. This is... He's got a guard next to him. What? He's got yeah, a guard oh, next yeah, to yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so is... Oh, yeah, so is... Yeah. But, I mean, he can... The Marzalea is chuntering chunter here, isn't he, with this old manzing? He's I mean, very it's, aggressive, very it's, aggressive. It's, it's very, very aggressive, but there is, you know, that much risk. There is only the Pomber and the Mighty Blow, and only one of them can hit the next turn. So yeah. you yeah. are not exposing that many players, and Chanter needs to invest a lot of rats to get uh, a lot of hits there, because there is a guard all over the place for the high elves yes it's, it's a very oppressive team on defense i do like this kind of player this was similar to my high elf team and I, like I, I i actually dominated the skaven on defense it was my offense that i lost with a wizard um yes and, and yeah you know you can base them up because the linos are only agility three which sucks and they you know you've got okay you're exposing good players but at the end of the day you've got so many good players that you can't not expose a good player to the claw pommer so you know it's not that bad I no, I like uh, being aggressive. I mean, uh, Chanter uh, left uh, the high elves a lot of space to surround them. You know, like, okay, I'm gonna surround all your team. I'm, I'm as fast as you. End of the day. Yeah. And if Chanter wants to take advantage of uh, this, I'm, I'm he needs to quietly. invest a lot of time, a lot of, a lot of rats. You're looking at this Jack Bull link, are you? Didn't. I am quietly blown away by the sock slider. Yeah. <laughs> 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 all right, I'm gonna watch it then. Okay, what the hell is this? It's, uh, that would make my life easier. I wonder how much they sell for. I, I guess every American needs one. I wonder 60% of Americans need one because it's just horrendous. Wow, this is aggressive. This is like when aggression meets aggression. I don't know about this. Oh, it's pretty, gonna... pretty good, actually, isn't it? Oh, well, the sock slider, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it makes, I was, like, looking at it, thinking, that looks stupid. And then I saw them roll the sock back, and I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, you just got a little bit excited by that. Yeah, I, was, <laughs> I was thinking, I, people are going to use this not to put the sock on the feet. Of course, he's going to go for the guard here. Yeah. No, he's, he's not dackering, is he? This is just more like an elf stall. Uh, we have your ball carrier back and everyone else getting beaten up. Almost yeah, the Marseille's like <laughs> going to wrap round though, isn't he? Mm. Yes, yes, La Marseille yes, can uh, more or less go wherever he wants because all his players are uh, IG4, so he has a lot of mobility there. Oh. Pals anyway, didn't matter about the tackle. But he gets to bang him out next turn. This, this can be a real good turn from Lamar's next turn. And he does get the hit on that strength four, as Dimmy predicted. Do we? I thought he would. Yes. If he dies. Oh yeah, my did. god. If, <laughs> uh, lads, I, I might understand Blood Bowl, you know? Maybe I'm not a moron. God, Chunter is such a dice lord, though, isn't and he? And he eats Fucking the cast. Not only cazzes him, but straight kills him as well. I think that's Doesn't probably still worth appoing. He didn't but, appo it? No. Ooh. Oh, is he AV bust or something? No, he just, he just, he just, it's only 50 50 at work, isn't it? That's just stupid. That's, I, I don't know why he took Frenzy on it, but 
Yeah. I mean, it's stupid to give a hit. I mean, I agreed with you that you shouldn't give it. Yes, yeah, there yeah. was uh, maybe a little to expose there. I didn't expose my strength 5 that much, and he was strength 5. <laughs> yeah, I don't understand the non apo Like, I just I don't know what you're thinking. Well, he's thinking it's only 50 50 at work, and he's going yep. to take other cars, and he wants players. I guess he just doesn't think the quality of that player is that much higher than the quality of, like, I mean, look how many good players he's got, right? He's got this, this Edge 5 one, he's got this Mighty Blow one, he's got this Garda, he's got this Garda, he's got this Garda. He's got this side stepper, this side stepper. He wants all those players, right? And so guaranteed getting one of them back instead of only 50-50 getting him back. I can I can understand it. I can understand. Do you know what I, do you know what I'm calling? I'm calling he took Frenzy. It pissed him off so much, he just <laughs> let it die. Yeah, yeah. I could, was, I could imagine. Call me, call me, call me, this yes, was such a me. stupid skill choice. Now's yeah. my opportunity just to correct it. I'm not mm. even going to apo that. I'm yeah. just going to let it die because it was it was wrong in the first place. I think frenzy on a uh, strength for a uh, higher catcher, you know, with so many skills already, it was all right. Yeah, I think it's all right as well, to be honest. But I, I would have still taken tackle, but yes, um, tackle, yes, uh, I'll probably go for tackle and then frenzy. I don't even mind sidestep, to be fair. Yeah. I'd go tackle, hundred percent. Strength four, you just need tackle because he's the guy who's blitzing ninety nine percent of the time. Although I guess he already had the mighty blow tackle. Well, you got the mighty blow yeah, tackle, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, Jim. Would elf catch to start with sprint. Alright. Hey. 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 <laughs> well, now I guess the uh, Chanter Skiller gets hit but... by Mighty Blow. Yep. Is he trying to sit with him? No, I think he's actually genuinely thinking about it. That was a pretty like high intensity turn. I don't know if uh, Chanter was expecting Lamar's to be that. Um, What's it called? Uh, aggressive. aggressive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And like the problem is, is I don't know why Lamar's is not. Uh, Lamar's is definitely just going to hit his pommel with Mighty Blow now, right? Which was the yes. problem with him dying yes. before he bombed. Yeah. Yes, yeah. And then, like, if they do trade, then it probably is a better trade for Lamar's today. But. That's only if they do Whoa. trade him. Oh no way! <laughs> what the what? hell? Uh, question mark? Really? I don't know. That, I think that's a big mistake. I would uh, go for the hit on the killer. I tell you what, it's not what I would have done. I mean, he can hit him anyway. Yeah, he uh, can, but he's got to clear this guard somehow. Which he does. Maybe that's what he was thinking. No, but the, he could. But you want you know, yeah, to go for the. Blow. Hit him with my e blow, God damn it! <laughs> the, the biggest chances of getting rid of that player from. Uh, because that's the one of the players that's going to kill all your team. Yes. Yeah, I would have definitely. I would have definitely hit him. Don't get me wrong. Oh, one million percent. Like. Oh, like, yeah, one million percent. I, I just don't even know why. I mean, a hundred percent, maybe, Demi, but yeah. A million percent. No, one million, yeah. <laughs> you this know, tackle you is can, doing uh, the job, right? Two pillars on You can hit him. him with a mighty blow. If you don't get him down, you can reposition to get other extra hits on him with the rest of the players you have around. Yeah, you know, so yeah I would right? definitely, I would, I mean, I would, hundred, I would have 100% I mean, hit him. Leader, leader, going for the leader, turn uh, two when leader is going for the... Well, anything that has happened, yeah, me too, me too, try. He's also not even getting to hit now. He's literally not even getting to hit this claw pommel. Oh my god. Imagine not even getting to hit him. And then he just knocks himself down against the mic. Maybe, maybe he's like Calcium and he plays with the skills off. Yeah, and maybe. He, yeah. he doesn't know he's a claw pommel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even if he just kill one of his best players. <laughs> Wait, that, that's so weird that Cows does that. It's yeah, like, it, no. It's the weirdest thing ever. I'll just look at the card. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can't. I, I can't. I can't handle that. Like watching a Kaz stream when he's playing. Yeah, that, mate, like, when, yeah, when you watch the stream, you always like you like put the skills on Kaz. Put the skills on Kaz, and he's yeah. just like, he's like, oh yeah, yeah, all right, I'll do it for you. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, literally every time he never has them on on his own. I've always got to ask him to put them on. Yeah, yeah, so everybody, at some point, at some point, finally, someone says, "Calcium, where are the skills?" <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's amazing. 
Early Lamar's tilt. I mean, it's hard to say what when when he's tilting and when he's not. To be honest. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Bit harsh. Um, like he's a good player. He's a good player. He's seventy percent. He's the he's the highest ranked player left in the tour in the semi finals. So, you know, highest win rate. So you well, know, is. Yeah, but he's the only one left in the tournament who hasn't won Chalice. Well, there's the other semi final which we don't know the result of yet. Oh, we don't know the result of that one. Okay. <laughs> who knows? Who knows? I don't know who played. Potentially. Who knows? But of the four semi finalists, yeah, two of them had won Chalice before, um, but Lamar's was the highest win rate. Yes, yeah, but well, win rate doesn't mean anything, like unless you're. It means you something. Because... It does. Sequence. It means something, but it doesn't mean anything. Like that's yeah, the but thing, Chanter but... also has a lower win rate because Chanter sometimes gets bored I and mean, do absolutely crazy things. Plays teams. ogres, yeah, he plays ogres, mm-hmm. and like <clears throat> both of these guys have been around forever, right? Both of these guys have like been around forever. Yeah. Like, but Lamar plays. Like, I wonder how many high off games it's got. You can you can find out. I'm I'm gonna do it right now. Uh, what is it? Health. Lamar. So 408. 408. Not that many. Well, that's just one race, though, isn't it? So it's yeah. like... Well, like when I you mean... compare it to Crystal's Skaven, that's like 1,600. Jesus. And then you compare that to Cruz's uh, Chorfs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 So yeah. Lamar's yeah. higher win rate than Chunter, right? Thousand. Lamar's yes. higher rate than Chunter there, and they're chills and teams. Yes, Chandler, and Chandler, are Chandler, definitely Chandler. worse than Skaven. <laughs> yes, yeah, but surely, Chandler. surely, this is another thing that might get a bit of backlash, but like, it's harder to have a higher win rate when you stream, right? Well, I'm not, I don't agree. No, I think that sometimes Chanter just do suboptimal uh, Skaven teams just for the lols. I mean, I don't even think it's for the lols a lot of the time. It's <laughs> Lamar, he's not even in there, is he? No, he's not in I mean, neither is Chanter, to be fair. Oh, that's high elves. Well, he's not in top 10 rats. Is he not? No, of course he isn't. Isn't he the only coach to win it with Skaven? Yeah, probably. But, like, he hasn't got a good win rate, has he? Oh, no, you said that other guy did. Gestionador? Oh, yeah, Gestionador, yeah. Gasol. Gasol. Gasol, yeah. Gasol, Gasol. One of them, too. Oh, Malidei. Malidei. The Mars is in with Skaven, wow. So there you go. El- so... Elliot's the third best high off player of all time. Right? Yeah, I'm not surprised. Elliot's a good player. I think he took him to the semi final, didn't he? The high offs. Mm. Beat, got beat by Dio. I mean, that's an, kind of a silly thing to say, Blasted Hunt. Well, no, no. <laughs> oh, it... another dead. Oh, wow. And this one, you also hit it. Because it's a random line, man. I mean. He would have rolled a push if he blitzed him anyway, but still, just like yeah, Gasol more was the was the scathing one. He's the worst coach to have won Chalice. <laughs> yes, dog to the dog. I'd probably be tilting now, getting diced. I mean, this one doesn't matter actually. This I mm-hmm. wouldn't care about this death at all. Um, and Rata Campara as well, Dado Quist. And also, to be fair, if I'd been playing, this guy would have been fucking stunned because I wouldn't have been a complete lunatic and not hit him at all. <laughs> so I wouldn't have taken that death. And also, I wouldn't have let him hit my strength four either. So it would have been in a completely different situation. So yeah, yes. tilt wouldn't happen to any of us because not any of us would have been in this situation. I think La Marseillaise is you know, the, using the advantage, the advantage he has in the first time, you know, he was able to surround the... Rat team, yeah, and he had like oh good chances to you know blitz good players, then uh, do another hits and all that, and it's like not finishing the job. No, it's it's like he just read a Reddit post that said to beat Skaven, base everybody up, and he went okay, and then it's just I'll not do worked it. out. <laughs> I'll do it, and then I'll do nothing about it. Yeah, you know, I'll, I won't use that advantage to get a lot of hits and make things difficult. Yeah, basically. Who won the who won the toss? Uh, probably Lamar's because Chunter would have kicked, wouldn't he? To one turn. To, Chunter would have kicked with Wizard. Within one turn, Chun, Chunter would have kicked hundred percent. So it must have been it must have been Lamar's won the toss. Yeah, exactly, Troy. Yeah. 
But I'm surprised that he's got that high win rate, Lamar's. Like, I don't really rate him particularly <laughs> from what I've seen of him. <laughs> I don't really rate him particularly highly. No offence to Lamar's. He's better than me, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, do we? But like I said, I don't rate uh, him particularly that was, that highly. That was a nice chain of uh, events that allowed him to get a nice hit on the gutter. So that was good. Yep. No. Like, he's all right. Don't, I mean, don't get me wrong. I just don't really rate him. Like, he's not shit. He's not shit. He's not shit. Like, he's good, obviously. Dimmy's better than average. You know, Dimmy's not bad at all. If I'm playing against um, Trent. <laughs> Way! <laughs> Way! <laughs> okay, 42 out of uh, 390 UKTC. I must be a legend. Glorious. Surely this guy has to stand here, right? Or, like, here. He's got he's to stand one of these places to, like, tie up all these guys. Surely. Surely he has to try and tie up guys. Oh, that means a lot, Corpax, because Tom Hanks is my favourite actor. There you go. Yeah, that's fair enough, Try That's fair enough. But still. It, it means something, doesn't it? That's all I'm saying. It means something. I mean, he has played a lot of games with a lot of races and has a high win rate, so he knows how to Blood Bowl. At least, you know, uh, a certain degree. Yes. I think he goes back in time, you know, he 100% blitz the killer. That was yes. a big mistake. Even he must feel in it like oh, that was a horrible mistake. Yes, he's got to. Like, he should definitely be thinking that right now. <laughs> you know, making, being, being, having a high win rate doesn't make you immune to mistakes. Yeah, yeah every, I think, even, even I think, Cole makes mistakes. I think Le Marcelet must have watched Jurassic Park before he played this game. And he's just thinking, if he doesn't move, then the claw pommel won't see him. <laughs> <laughs> if I just pretend he's not there, like nothing bad will go wrong. But the thing is, you're playing versus Chanter, you know, Chanter is going to go, you know, uh, no remorse, no regrets. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to keep using, you know, his killing tools all the time. I'm calling, I'm calling a pitch clear here. I reckon Chanter's going to pitch clear him. Yeah. That will be absolutely brutal, but the absolutely, absolutely possible, possible the way things are going. Yeah, I don't think it'll be. I don't think it'll be that brutal, but it's, it's, yeah, it's certainly possible that he will bang him out a lot. Okay, now I think the hit for Chanter is uh, killing the Surhans player. Yeah, honestly, try. I think this was kind of like. I don't think this was horrific, but yeah, he's let him hit. Like I can't believe you don't tag that guy out. Um... I think that's what he's tried to do, right? He's tried to go with, like, most of Chunter's team is shit. So if I can, like, get all of these people on him, then something good will happen. <laughs> like, I think that was kind of his plan. Yes, that was the original plan, and, and I agree with being very aggressive. You know, you have the guard, you have the blodger, you have the, the speedy and everything, but you need to, you know... Yeah, but he can't to... not try. He can't... Like, this is what I'm saying, right? He can't not expose his good players, right? He's got this strength for and okay, that's maybe his best player. But he's also got this bludge guarder. He's got this bludge guarder with sure hands. He's got this this bludge guarder with sidestep. He's got this edge five with rackle. Like, he's got so many good elves. He's got this mighty blow on, so that you just think, fuck it, go balls to the wall. He's going to get a blitz every turn, but he's going to get a blitz every turn anyway, right? And then hopefully you get... Now, I don't think he's, he's done enough. I don't think he's produced enough to make it worth the risk or anything, but... Exactly, I, I absolutely agree. I think uh, he should have been uh, targeting uh, with a mighty blow elf, the killer, as soon as he had the, the chance. Jesus, man. Chunts, Chunts is a... Uh, Open the back of Tatos. <laughs> it's Tato time. Yes, Paravelli did. I mean, they're quite likely to bang people out, aren't they? Especially with the horns now as well. I love horns. Horns is one of my favourite skills. Exactly. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, you know that player with the horns, that, that should be your target. Ooh. Ooh. Your target number one. Because he doesn't need anyone to kill all your players. He, he just blitzes into them and kills them. 
Could have just stood this guy up first. Jesus Christ, Chum. Well, the DP wants the foul. Yeah. But was it worth making that a 1D? Uh, well, it's guard there anyway. Well, this one isn't guard, didn't he? Oh, what you mean? Doesn't foul, doesn't foul, it's just a mistake. Oh, uh, okay. Just a mistake. <coughs> oh, pose his blood there. Not straight dead, wow. Yeah, can't believe it. <laughs> the edge 5 being prone is, means he can't do anything. What's a new la victoire mean uh, in French? Anyone? No. Well, the, uh, uh, the victory is ours, or uh, we towards the victory. Oh. Could just go around think... and can't recover though, can he? No, this is their drive mat though, it's just that they've been banged. Well, they haven't been banged, they, they've done the banging, but they've been... They were kind of out-positioned, kind of. But then... Lamar's just didn't get enough bang for his... Well, enough book for his getting banged. <laughs> no, he has Basically. been a uh, old player. Old leapy here. rat's getting blitzed there, right? Or is he blitzing the ball? I wouldn't bother blitzing the ball, I would just try and make it so that he's got a score and then you win. Or would you blitz the stripper? With a mighty blow? Blitz the claw pump. Learn your lesson, Lamars. Don't be a fucking idiot again. <laughs> yeah, but yes, the, yes, the... It's not with mighty blow, is it? It's, uh... No, but who cares? Just, who cares? Just blitz him and get loads of players through. And then Chunter can't stall. Hopefully. And then you win 2-1 grinding. I mean, he can get a 2D on the Claw Pommer if he does a 3, uh, a three plus dodge. Nah, I, think, I think it's better just to get just to get through it. Get some threat on. Lamar okay, says once he's a sure hands player dead. <laughs> Alright, that's a little better. Yeah, that was, that was a player, wasn't it, getting his strength for? Exposing strength four, but that's the thing. Like he, he had to expose a good player. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's impossible. So you have to play with that thing that you know. I have so many good players that there is going to be always uh, willing to be a target. When you know, mm. but not going, you know, after the crop bomber after that hit, yeah. is like what are you doing? And then you know, leaving the crop bomber do whatever he wants all the game is like what are you doing, mate? That that guy is destroying your team. Yeah, that's one of a chanter's win condition. Yep. And if you are basing every single rat, that's fine because you have a better team, but you need to take advantage of that. You can just, you know, uh, be scared. Yeah. No, I get what you're saying. Well, I mean, it wouldn't have been so bad if he was exposing them for a reason, right? That's the thing, Troy. Like, I didn't like that. I mean, I said I didn't like it, but I can see his thinking, you know? Like, you can see the thinking, right? But, yeah, obviously you shouldn't have just exposed him for, like, no reason and no payoff. But if he had been able to generate something, like, good from it, then I, then I, then I think it's worth it for sure. Oh, dear. What? I mean... <laughs> As Lamar says, yes, uh, yes, yes, he with uh, uh... <laughs> Jesus try. <laughs> oh, dear. Yes, Matt. I mean, that's the best. Way, that's the absolute best way to reduce his impact. The yes, problem with yes. horns is you can't guard like it with strength three team. You know. So. pretty much the way you've got you've got to like mark him out with crap players which he doesn't have too many of 
and one of the crap players that he marked him out with did get killed. So you know. That's it. Every everybody else has the skills. Yeah, it's it's tough. It is tough. But yes, you do want to try and marginalise them without killing them because it's not easy to kill them. <laughs> no, no, no. It's not easy at all. I mean, you need to be very lucky. But even an armor break and keeping him in stand gives you so much space to breathe. You know, to hit other pieces because after all, Chandra's team is what three players. Yeah. Four players? Yeah, pretty much. Four. I'd say four. I, I'd say four players are the ones that uh, really matters. The, the, the D, three... I mean, the DP does some, the, does some work. DP can Am do I? work, the guard can do work. Like, it's just a guard, but it's still a guard, right? It's still like... It's a guard with armor seven. It's a guard with armor seven. So it's also the three guards and the claw pump. But yeah, it's three, it's three guards and the claw pump, yeah. The one that is not a mandatory is the leader piece. You know, I don't know why it was the obsession, you know, the Lamar is going for uh, the leader uh, piece. Maybe it was the easiest target, but it's like... It wasn't. The Claw Pommel was the easiest target, <laughs> which is, makes I mean, it this even is, weirder. This is to get down. It makes it even weirder. Yeah, easiest like... to get down, yeah, 75%. This is to get down, 75%. Oh, okay, yeah. But yeah, I agree. He should have. He should have. Like the first turn was fine going for him. He was exposed. He was screening the. Yeah, I would have hit the leader first turn and the yeah. claw on the second turn. Yes. Yeah. What I was thinking, but again, who am I? To, to judge? No, no. Also, uh, Chandler has the leader uh, usually for the one turners. Yeah. Well, you just have leader for chalice. Like four re rolls in chalice is really strong. Like a lot of good coaches will take an extra re roll in chalice, like over CCL. CCL is all about keeping your TV low and then... Yes, yes, the CCL usually... Chalice is all about maximising your chance to win a game of a one-off Blood Bowl, isn't it? So. Mm. Mate, you wait till uh, <clears throat> Blood Bowl 3 and it's like multiple re-rolls a turn. Like, I, I reckon we might see some five re-roll teams and all that. Yeah, who knows what it's going to be like. Well, Chanter is playing in serious Chanter mode now. Is he gonna... Gonna score, isn't he? Can't get away from the record. Oh, he's not gonna score. No, he just put the player there to get the extra, extra hit there. So, yeah. Is he blitzed? Is he just dodge blitzing? Okay, he's just dodge blitzing. One day. No, he's got horns. He has That's horns. For the three plus dodge. This is definitely an apo. This is a pylon here. No need because he can reach now, but oh, there you go, kill! He got a pylon. Oh. Yeah, so he didn't put that much through, right? He needed to put more through, more to prevent the score, I think. Whereas now he. He's gonna, he's gonna have a three turns to score the Mars, probably, but he's gotta make sure that. He's got to make sure that Chunter has to score next turn. That was a bit risky, yeah, sick. Yes, 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 but that's, that's how uh, Chunter uh, thinks. 89 times that this dodge is perfect. Yep. I, I, I agree, try, but he's got to try and try to make him. Yeah, he's not going to. He's got three players down, too far away. I, I agree. Okay. Not gonna get him to score. Now it's time to kill the Surhans Rat. Yeah. I think that will be the that one of the downless one. I mean, <laughs> there is only four players. Third, third pair of veil, right? There was the the dodge in and the handoff. <laughs> so the third critical one in nine. Talking of critical, hey, hey, oh, hey, critical fail again. Hey. Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, critical fail. Sunday night, eight p.m. <laughs> UK time. <laughs> it's gonna be amazing, guys. That's what we should we should call it that instead of critical. Uh, where, uh, yeah, snack. critical fail. Roll is the uh, yeah, yeah. Critical fail is pretty good. Yeah, we'll go with critical fail. Because <laughs> it's quite funny as well, you know. Yeah. You know. You know. Yeah, yeah, I know. 
Uh, Jimmy, they are already most dice uh, the player of Dungeons and Dragons. I yeah. am. I only had one session and it was appalling. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, squirrel dude, yeah. I broke my bow <laughs> trying to shoot somebody. <laughs> Dimmy nearly killed Cass. <laughs> Not my always. first action, my first action in the whole game was face plant in the floor. Yeah. <laughs> in heavy plate armor, yeah. Yeah, which isn't heavy, which is a bit silly. I guess that's like a Dungeons and Dragons conceit, but it's not yeah. actually heavy armor at all, was it? They, they could do forward rolls, no problem, in in, heavy, in full plate armor. But never mind. What, I, oh, I don't know. Yeah. I wouldn't want to try it. Well, you wouldn't, but you know you'd roll a one. But yeah, they could totally do like four rolls and everything. I could do like a, uh, I could do a pencil roll, definitely, <laughs> but not a, not a forward roll. Forward rolls, do they could jump on horses, everything. Like, what's the point of the armor if they couldn't? <laughs> I hit with my heavy fail. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, duh. <laughs> I'd love, I'd love to have a bow and arrow. Honestly, I'd love to have a bow and arrow. You know that, like, like in England, when like back in six, what hundreds of years ago, they instead of going to church, like they had to shoot the bow. Like every kid from like seven yes. to eleven had to shoot a bow. Yeah, long time ago, but yeah. Yeah, I, I say we bring it back. I say we bring it back. Yeah, it was happy days. Yeah. Was it after church? Was it? Uh, I'd skip church and have an extra bow and arrow lesson, I think. Yeah, me nah. too. Back in Timmy's I'm not that old, Perryvale. You're older than me. <laughs> you're, you're well older than me, aren't you, Perryvale? This guy's doing gymnastics! What the hell? There you go. <laughs> Amazing. There you go, okay. look. Look at this, Dimmy. I'll put the link in chat. What's this? Is it... Oh, wow! <laughs> Forward roll! <laughs> he didn't roll a one on that. He didn't, did he? Yeah, but the funny thing is... At the end of this, what they should do is show someone shooting that arm with an arrow and it just flying straight through it. <laughs> <laughs> Literally going from the front straight through the back. Oh, I know that video. I know that video. I've seen it many times. Yes, the, the explanation of, I can be very agile on uh, armor. I don't know many uh, knights who had Nikes either, Jimmy. <laughs> Not many, but there was one, wasn't there? In that movie, I remember. Where's he going? Oh, right. <laughs> you tricked me with that with it being with it being Facebook. I would completely. <laughs> Kenny, I didn't. I couldn't see what it was gonna be. Oh man! What is it? It's it's you falling over again. Why is it on Facebook? <laughs> because it's just a big convoluted link to convoluted link to get people to click on it. A knight's tale. Thank you, Marzum. Yeah, there you go. Critical fail. <laughs> Critical <laughs> fail. <laughs> it's not brass oh. balls, is it? I mean, he's you, you've got a stall. It's an easy stall, really, wasn't it? Like, as tri oh, yeah, okay. No I, was, I was watching you stream tabletop the other day, and I couldn't figure out whether you was the geezer on the left or the geezer on the right. And it weren't Warhammer, was it? It was something else. It was like another... Was it like a Lord of the Rings? or It weren't Lord of the Rings, was it? I saw you streaming... Like, I watched a bit of it, I watched a fair bit of it, but I couldn't figure out which one you were. War Machine, that's it, War Machine. Oh, yeah, I played that once. Well, I didn't since I played I did the intro game in a store, and this guy was like, holy shit, you're the most tactical player we've ever had in this shop. And I'm like, well, yeah, I'm not a fucking idiot, am I? <laughs> did, they, did they throw you out? <laughs> no, I just, I thought I should, that. I, should, I, I thought that to myself. I'm probably yes, going. it's really surprising every single time uh, Jimmy enters a shop, he's the best <laughs> ever uh, been entering yeah. that shop. Yeah, I mean, obviously, really, isn't it? This war machine any good, or is it? I thought it was shit. Uh... Five plus dodging, you might as well do it, yeah. 
Like it sucks, but might as well do it. Oh, if he fails, he's not getting claw bombed. Bonus. Is it a four? No, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's a five still. Hard to get around to cover it to stop the assists, though, isn't it? It's actually yeah, it's shit. Yeah, maybe you don't go in. Maybe you try and give yourself a two turn chance <laughs> with your five elves that are left. It's crazy how he doesn't seem to have any players, but like he does. Three, four, five, six, He's got seven, ten. eight, nine. He's got nine on the field. Yeah, but next half. Yeah. No, he's got ten next half because he's got a reserve, but it's shit. I mean, they're still better than the rats, but it's the wizard, isn't it? Yeah, they're better yeah. overall, but like, they're better overall, but like, chunt has got the better players, hasn't he? Like, that's the thing. Ch chunt has got like the four best players on the field. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Yes, I think uh, yes, more or less that, that's the thing, and that's why they should be in the ones you know being targeted every single time. Well, mate, I think that's where El, like high elves really fall off is like their lack of fouling game because like fouling rats is really strong, mm. and uh, they just don't have it in their vocabulary, do they? Not really. Not much. No, you need to be really, really high TV to afford a lino with a dirty player. Mm. But again, Doctor the Dog, the ship positioning of last turn was due to the positioning of the turn before, right? Like it just—it's just all a—it's all just a horrible snowball of shit for the mass, <laughs> basically. Okay, now we are hitting the proper players. Avalanche. <laughs> yeah, that dead catcher might have been top four, and this and this edge five to be fair, but not really like the mighty blow. Like I don't know, like this is a this gut is pretty good, isn't it? And obviously the claw bomb is the really really strong. Yeah, exactly. So it's the 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 like the his his equity has like spiraled, hasn't it? Due to the previous turns. Like, it's like he had a bathtub full of equity and then he pulled the plug out, and it's just been <laughs> <laughs> it's just yeah. been draining away. So, but like that's so. what it is, isn't it? It's like the cumulative the cumulative sum of decisions made. Basically, isn't it? And yes, the 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 the, the snowballing of uh, bad decisions here and there create a complete disaster. Yeah, he hasn't. What's he doing that for? I'm not sure he's had a good. I'm not sure he's had a good turn. <laughs> the mass. He he could have one a good chance if he had made the right choices. In my opinion, the ones yeah. that were the right choices. In my opinion. Oh, he's but... based in the claw palm because he doesn't want his mighty blow getting hit with the claw palm. Okay. Oh yeah, yes, because yeah. after all, it's not like the a chanter has a p uh, pieces with guard. Yeah, that's yeah. that's fair try. Yeah, he did he did that turn when he wrapped around. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was quite risky. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, when he had to uh, tato run when away. He forced the tato. Know? Yes. He did it last turn. Oh, I mean, Chanter's gonna three blood, dodge three plus to kill something every <laughs> day of the week. Yeah, no, 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 Timmy, when he had to do the dodge in with the ball and then the handoff in two tackles on, so like he did two three pluses, didn't he? Which either one loses him the game. Which, you know. Well, probably way. doesn't lose him the game because of the wizard, but it, it would, probably yeah, it would, it would be a massive equity shift. Yeah. You know Pro how Jimmy is. Jimmy is the binary, is uh, like uh, <laughs> any mistake is instant losing the game. You know, it's a switch off, mistake yeah. off, game lose. Okay, guys, see you later. Yeah. Ciao, Bella. <laughs> but if it's something bright and this unger, bad, and so us, you know, you need to keep fighting. Yeah, this isn't bad, is it? This isn't a bad. This isn't a bad turn at all from Lamar's alert. I think it forces the score, which is what we had to do. I think it forces the score. I'm not yes, entirely sure. Yes, I think uh, he's going to hit the... You just think jump over him, mate. You, you slip the guard. He won the Slip the, slip no, the guard before, in. Be, before that, he's going to move the, down guard. the guards. Then you claw upon the, the, the blood stepper and then you just yeah jump yeah. over the catcher. Or one move day. the guard one, one up. To the right, so he can uh, to hit the uh, the blotch uh, guard piece with a killer because he's chanter. He he loves <laughs> to kill things, and then you have uh, still you have the blitz and everything to use with your other players. Yeah, so he's good. He's 
Yeah, okay, so maybe it's not stolen. The 1D and then stall was pretty, pretty, man, uh, not really, it's pretty shit. Okay, so he's, he's moving around, interesting. Trying to move around and failing, I guess. He's, but it looks like he's, he is just dodging through now. Yeah, this does seem shit. I don't like this play at all. I don't really understand what that was at all. That was not probing. That was. That was an investment. Shit. That was the blitz. That was the blitz. That's a big investment there. And that was just being shit. Like I don't even. I thought that guy would would go, you know, somewhere else. Yeah, like it's, that's just weird. That's just weird. I don't, I don't get it. You could put the like you can put the guard in and blitz through him on two and then score, or you can put the guard in and punch and punch, and then one d through or whatever. Like it's so weird. Yeah, exactly. The guard could have just given you a two d blitz through if you're gonna score. If you're gonna score, the guard the guard comes in and you and you two d him and score. Yeah, but I want to claw up him. <clears throat> I could agree to it. Well, if you want to claw up him, then you put the guard in there and you claw up him and then you score. Yes. In one yeah, that's what I would have done. That's what I would have yeah. done. I put the but, guard like, I don't in know what there. The fuck. I don't know what the fuck Chunter was trying to do. <laughs> he, he, he doesn't want to score this turn, does he? This, this is what it was. Yeah, but, like, but how does this achieve it? We'll get there. We'll get there. Let's, let's wait for the magic to appear. Yeah. We you just haven't, you haven't guys, seen the play, guys, Jim. You have not seen the play, guys. Yeah. You have not seen the play, guys. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> Boy, me has just got banned from Elio's channel. <laughs> I guess the players just do shit plays. It's going to be amazing, and then roll guys. Back. It's not shit. It's, it's fine. It's pretty shit, mate. <laughs> it's not what you would have done, Jim. It's pretty shit. I, that's, that's pretty shit, yeah. Uh, to be honest, that is. Uh, he could have just done a two. He could have just done a two dice block to do that, instead of doing a two plus and another two plus. That was uh, did not like. But there you go. Two turn for Lamar's. No way. Interesting. No way. <laughs> I'm calling a blitz. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. Blitz into five minutes disconnection by Le Marseilles. <laughs> Fair enough, try. <laughs> oh, yeah, Kalon. Yeah, it's hard though when someone does something shit, isn't it though? <laughs> I don't know how to call something shit not shit. So. You've been taking your Artemis tablets, haven't you? I mean, Artemis calls slightly something slightly suboptimal shit. This was just <laughs> shit. There's wow. no way of getting around it. Head elf on a rock. I reckon it's a blitz. I can feel a blitz. There's been so many blitzes this chalice. This no, chalice has been, been yeah. full of blitzes. Like, it's been insane. Penetración. That's in Spanish. Penetration. <laughs> And I mean, like, Rats are probably just the best team at Blitzes, right? Barring maybe Woodies. And I, I think even Rats are better than that. I don't know. Movement 9 is just disgusting. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, Try, yeah. Thirty percent even, Dog to the Dog. I think he maybe was counted with a grab to do something if you push at him or something like that. Oof. I don't know. Oh, it would be hilarious if the master Lay just set up like this. <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty good defenseless guy here, but then the claw bomber's there, but then there's two good rats there, so you've got to go this way, haven't you, I guess. I mean, this should be an easy two-turn, really, apart from the wizard. Yeah, apart from the elephant. Still got 10 players. And if you use the wizard here, then you're kind of pretty happy about that, aren't you, to be fair? Like he's only using it to stop the touchdown, not score one. 
Yeah, exactly try. Like, yeah, I thought it was shit. Hopeful. Okay, it was a very hopeful idea. Yeah, that's fair. Hopeful is a synonym for shit, isn't it, basically? <laughs> very hopeful play from Trump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the edge, he had a edge five rackle to hit him. Like, and yeah, maybe shit is harsh because obviously shit is the people who are like seventeen percent. Do you mean no rule? Not not channel level. <laughs> yeah, shit is shit is leaving a gaping hole in your one turn defense because you think that uh. They can't do it because bull sentinels are only movement seven, um, and they're edge two, so they can't dodge through the backline. So you don't backline. That's shit. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, that is shit. Um, but that was also. I mean, that was pretty shit for for a chalice semi final. That was shit. I mean, shit is Steve Morty being killer in uh, Among Us when it's your partner. Well, hey, yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Steve, love you. Yeah. Shit is Steve Motty not being Steve Motty in Among Us. There was a literal imposter in Among Us oh, for the first how time ever. Oh, funny was that? <laughs> how funny was that? It was amazing. It was funnier than the Swarm Lord, that's how funny. The, the red Steve Motty. Incredible. I did think it was weird that it was red with a completely different, like, attire. Yeah, I mean, shit would have just been what? absolute shit people do right like you know we've all seen we've all seen people playing them on stream we've all played them on stream people just do weird horrendous things for no reason like seemingly at random like that's all the shit moves sure but still you don't expect Le Marcele and Chunter to like play at random do you so for them it's shit like you've got to be realistic this is a shit or setup by the way what the fuck is this I guess it protects against Blitz a little bit but how the hell is he scoring this? Like, literally, what is he even doing here? How is he even scoring this touchdown? I've got no idea. Agent through the middle, isn't he? This is fucking horrendous. <laughs> no, he's not caging through the middle. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> he's, he look, he's pushing the side. Opposite to his edgy five catcher. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So the edge five is just going to dodge through, and then he'll what dodge a couple of people through here on three two and twos. Didn't blitz with mighty blow. Yep. Yeah, yeah. That was was the point of having the mighty blow there then. Questionable. Oh yeah, questionable. That's a good one for shit. Yep. Yeah, Jilly. Yeah, I didn't like. I didn't like not putting the ball in the vampire. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, that was a hard position, right? So. I didn't actually hate the Zondaka in that situation. It was just always going to be hard. He's not leap He's not leaping over, no. The gut is just going to come and get him. Like, how fast are they? It's ridiculous, isn't it? Flipping gutters. I hate gutter runners. Well, I don't really hate them, but you know what I mean. They can be annoying sometimes. <clears throat> You're like Darth Vader, mate. <laughs> <laughs> well, cool. you've got you've got a, a something, haven't you, when you're streaming? <laughs> and it's easier to say I hate this than. Oh. This Feel is, the hate flowing through you. It's easier to say I hate this than this is mildly suboptimal. Uh, <laughs> unsolicited uh, DACA pick. Do you know, did you know that I got an unsolicited DACA pick? It's not even a joke. I, I genuinely got an unsolicited DACA pick from Marzen at NAF Champs. He was at NAF Champs. Yes, I think it, at NAF Champs. It was a DACA with dwarves. Yeah. A dwarven DACA, you it a, savage. It was a dwarven DACA, he just sent me it. He sent me an unsolicited DACA pick. <laughs> oh, rip, add G5. Yep. I should have put it on their strength for very good Saturday. <laughs> yeah, I mean, some people just see it wrong. 
don't they? Like, some people just see the game wrong, right? Like, that is definitely true. Like, new players and bad players are just wrong compared to try about some things, right? They're just categorically wrong. And I'm struggling to see what the upside was to Chunter's play. Yeah. That was a really weird turn. Yeah, but what you probably didn't, he probably had something else planned and swapped it. Yeah, he did have something planned, but it was I still can't see what it was. So I don't think it was good. But, but you, probably... you, comparing you to Chunter at Blood Bowl is like comparing like chips and I don't know, non chips. Yeah, something something better, a lot better than chips and chips. Yep. And, uh, wow. I, I think now the blitz is clear on the IG5. <laughs> I'm glad Try liked it. <laughs> I mean, I don't think he's that much better than YouTube. <laughs> hey. No, obviously, 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 I'm not that much better than him. I mean, like, he's fine, right? He's fine to to stomp shitters on ladder, and then he's got a high variance team in playoffs that can definitely win, as he has done before. So there you go. Like, he's fine. He's totally fine. He's a solid tier two coach. Nothing. We're talking that. about chunts. All right. Like, there's nothing wrong, is it? Like, you know, he doesn't... It's not offensive, is it, to say that, is it? <laughs> but Why? I don't think he's tier two. Mm. Well, he's not tier three. <laughs> yeah, I agree, yeah. <laughs> I think Chanter is really close to the entire uh, one coach. Yeah, I agree. Uh, no happy chuckles. I failed to qualify the best Wood Elf team that I've ever had. <laughs> yeah, S tier special. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Put the uh, Chandler in the tier one. I mean, it but depends how, how big your tiers are, how, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, how big is yeah, your tier? Yeah, if your tier yeah. one's only five players, <laughs> yeah, then yeah. fair enough. But like, if you're talking, uh, I don't yeah, know. depends how, how many spots have your tier one uh, level for coaches. Yeah, yeah, exactly, Try. If you only have two tiers, then he's tier one, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know. Just is what it is. Yeah. If you have six tiers. Yeah, but then, like, for me... It's like Dio and Kfo and then everyone else. That's right. I think Dio's number one. Oh my god. I think Dio is undisputedly number one for like everything that oh isn't in the game of Blood Bowl. You know, like, do you know what I mean? Like prep and everything like that and mindset and all that kind of stuff. I'd put Dio in his own tier for that. Apple works. I did Apo that one. It would have been hilarious if he didn't have had that one. <laughs> I would have stopped watching. I would have gone home. Mm. Well, I, would, I, I am home. <laughs> I will also put Crucifer on tier one. Yes. No doubt. If four Chalice. Yeah, four Chalice. Like, I don't know. It depends what you call Blood Bowl. If you call CCL Blood Bowl, then yeah. Like, definitely Crucifer's tier one. Well, he also won a uh, Blitz Pit. Yeah. I've, I've, Wolf Bark is probably one of the best players that doesn't stream. But, like, I like, is he your tier one? Like, I don't know. It depends what you call your tier one, isn't it? It does It does depend on things. He can, he can do all right here, can't he? He can put Guard in there, block him, and then uh, there's only one Tackle Zone on here. And he can Blitz through and score. Alright, alright, here's another is here's another question for chat then, like who's better Chunter or Davo? I would say Davo. Well, I'd I'd say it's pretty close. I'd say it's no, pretty I'd close. Say Dave. I wouldn't even think about it. <laughs> six <at> six. <laughs> I wouldn't even think about it. <laughs> I I I say uh, Davo, yes. Like yeah, I, I agree, Dog to the Dog. I would agree, yeah. I would agree. Uh, in general, I tend to put my money on Chanter just because of Chanter. So is Davo tier 1? 
Yeah. Yes. Okay. Oh, he's blocked his path. Well, he's blocked it anyway, hasn't he? He's just got to dodge then, hasn't he? He's just got to dodge through with the... Because uh... he hasn't got the movement, has he? He's just got to... Oh, no, he's got, he's got an extra one. He's got an extra one, so... Oh, but then if he blitzes, then it costs him it. So he's, he's got to dodge, then hit. Right, he's got to dodge, then hit. And then score. He's got a leap. Okay. Well... You still dodge, you still dodge hit, don't you? Oh, now you've got a real one there, so you just dodge, dodge, leap, dodge off. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, just give him two men leaping over. I guess he's leaping over. Isn't dodge hit better? No, because then you're doing a two plus. Yeah, I guess leap, leap, dodge is the best. Oh yeah, dodge it first. Works. No, because this is a one in nine. Uh, maybe it's your leap first. Okay. Yeah, you blitz, and then if you power him, you can leap. Yeah, yeah, that's okay, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, if you power him, you could leap over the bodies. <laughs> oh, Oops. there you go. There we go. It's Le Marcel 8 here, what? <laughs> Way. 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 And, like, it's hard to say as well, right, because you've also got, like, how people handle big games and stuff, and, like, what people's higher level is and what their average level is and stuff like that, right? And, like... People who exploit bad players better and people who rise to the occasion. There's a lot there's a lot to go into it to be fair. Elliot is Which I rise to the occasion tier one. Too. Really? I mean Of course Elliot is tier one. Jesus, that guy knows how to blood ball. Yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah, devil's a, a, Devil's S tier bad player exploiter. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 that's true. He can build a team in two games versus uh, two bad coaches. <laughs> I mean, just variants, just variants. You know, and also Elliot can tends to like crumble mentally in big games a little bit. No, no offense. <laughs> and like, you know, and that mistake that you made against Chun, it was just horrendous. It was just absolutely horrendous, you know. Like, he doesn't make that mistake. Like, Elliot could play 122 games with Nurgle and make that mistake like about three times maybe or something and he's just unlucky that he made it against Chunter. If he doesn't make that mistake then he wins, you know? So... Where's PC? Also put the PC in tier one. Yeah. I mean, he's certainly in tier one with dwarves. <laughs> yes, try. Yeah. Like Devo could have easily won a chalice. Like everyone could have. Like everyone who's good could have easily won a chalice. You know. Like. Yes, a chalice. A winning chalice or not winning chalice at some point, you know, is uh, so many factors. Mm. That is like it's not the proof you are a. Uh, better coach than a guy, you know, a guy that won Chalice is not a guaranteed proof you are better than the coaches that hasn't won Chalice. Yeah. Right. Inarian, Inarian pitch cleared, pitch cleared, uh, what's he called? Muddy D in the final with, with Wood Elves versus Skaven. He pitch cleared the Skaven. And like, you know, Muldy wins that game probably 70% of the time. And, and as it was, he got pitch cleared and lost. Like, it's crazy. And now in Arians won two or three chalices and Bulls won none. But like it was an absolute complete me comedy mega dicing, like ridiculous comedy mega. Yeah, that's, that's fair. Terrific. That's terrific. That's fair. Terrific. That's fair. Yes. And luck at some point uh, stops being a factor because you have played so many games. Hmm. Hello, Stor, baby. Stor. Who, actually, who actually watches NASCAR? Good point. I the, think the people uh, in the stadium, the people in the stadium watch it. It's really um, cool for the people in the stadium, right? Because if you think about it, if you go to like an F1 thing or whatever, you only see a little bit of it, don't you? But if you go there, you see like the whole thing, and you get to see them go around in circles forever. Don't, don't <laughs> yeah, they just give tickets to homeless people to make it look cool? 
don't know. And they have a, a cheap beer, so you can watch it even while you are getting drunk, which I think is the whole point of the thing. <laughs> <laughs> because NASCAR is the most redneck thing you can imagine. Cars on a circuit, you know, and you're just waiting for the crash. <laughs> Oh, uh, shout out PC. <laughs> yeah, PC's a bit of a nah, weird one. Nah, I think PC with dwarfs is tier one. PC with dwarfs is definitely tier one. PC is a bit of a weird one because he is noticeably better with dwarves than the other things, but you would still wouldn't want to face him with anything else, would you? Do you know what I mean? Darko so, like, was pretty good. He's, he's not really, yeah, he's not really a one trick. Like, do you know what I mean? He just comes across as a one trick because he plays dwarves so much, basically. Yeah, it's the same with people with uh, Crucifer saying that it was, you know, one trick because he always plays chores and that one season got angry and qualified like with five teams. Yeah. I would yeah. I would love to see Crucifer like a uh, uh, res event. I know he's played BBSL and Dome and Blitz stuff. Pit. Blitz Pit, yeah. Does Crucifer Cruci 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 yeah. yeah. With Nurgle as well, wow. And, uh, and Pro Elves. Hasn't uh, Colian won uh, Blitz Pit and Chalice? If he's sniper, you know. Yeah. No, no. Yeah. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. <laughs> I agree that I was his sniper, you know. Look at this. What a devastating <laughs> LOS on that Armour 17. <laughs> oh, my God. This is... Yeah, this is... <laughs> this is, what I I, they're this they're... is another thing that I don't like about Skaven. Like, it's so stupid. Yeah, okay. They're Armour 7. There's, the line rats will crumble. Oh, what if they don't? Then Are we going to get a just horrible, poof? Have we got a puffed in chat? Oh, here, yeah. There's got to be. There's got to be a puffed in chat. I, I would puff that. <laughs> yeah, coming in. Hot I mean, he's, he's he's one one. He's one one. If that if that wizard fails, like he's almost favourite, right? Yeah, yeah. Would a wizard fail? I think he is favourite. But oh yeah, I mean, yeah. If there was no the wizard here, he'd be favourite, right? Because he's got sure hands as well. So yes. the, the sacking threat isn't as isn't as dreadful. He's probably got a very wet monitor though. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. <laughs> Guys love Cruz because Cruz played hundreds of games every season, you know, to get that ultra powerful teams because that was his uh, reasoning. If my team is not able to win Chalice, I'm not even bothering. I'll yeah. delete the team. Yeah. I used to watch his streams and I see him uh, deleting a team that was like yeah, 25 daily, 0, daily, 0 my, or something like that because he lost dead. two players. Thanks, mate, for bringing that up. Appreciate it. Jesus Christ, we, we have reached an age, you know, that the uh, mom Joe's is like, oh, come on. Mm. And I agree, I watch, I tend to watch him streams in the morning because it was, I was working and all that, it was absolutely perfect. And it was like, uh, it was very good because it was a uh, bash, so I could play and suddenly when I hit a cast, I could watch the game, what happened there? Oh, he killed something. Mm. And like the thing about the thing about Cruz is like, yeah, he always had like, you know, one of the top probably four teams in Chalice every single season. And like, if if you know if somebody say like Try had done that, then Try would have maybe won six or seven or eight or five. You like you just don't know, do you? But at the end of the day, Cruz has got to get a lot of respect for actually getting the team into that like state and qualifying every single time, didn't he? Like, so he did it. He did do a great job doing that every season. How many sure. times has uh, Try actually qualified? Is it like four times? For Something try? like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's ridiculous. And then and one he's won two of them. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. You know, if if Core had done, if Core had just had just smashed Chorf games every season like Cruz did, he would have he would have probably won more. But he didn't, and Cruz did. So that's it, isn't it? Like, that's the end exactly. of the bit. Cave O is basically where Amazon's Will Never Win Chalice came from because yeah. he's that good at Blood Bowl mm. and he qualified Zons that many times and didn't even come close. Yeah. I think mean, Amazon, so. Yeah. Four, Jay, does he? Four. Four. You've qualified on an alt. Taco Torti. Yes. We, we will always remember Taco Torti. <laughs> yes, eh. Uh... Also, it was when uh, Core started playing CCL, you know, trying to prove Dimmy wrong, kill him. Yeah. Well, and no, 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 like, to be fair, like, k was winding down when I came to Blood Bowl, really. And like, same uh, with Dio. Dio came back, well, I say the Amazons to prove Dimmy wrong, fail and have to leave. <laughs> I'll be interested in. to see if k comes back with Blood Bowl 3, because he says the main reason he doesn't play Blood Bowl 2 is because it's an outdated rule set. So, with Blood Bowl 3 being an up-to-date rule set, I wonder if he does come back. 
Interesting. Well, Skuro hasn't done anything in Chalice, has he? We were t more talking about chalices and ladder up a big deal. Well, the problem with Chalice is qualifying. Like, it's just like you have to invest so much time. <laughs> yeah. Yes, and it's yes. brutal. It's like yes, I remember it's just... having this conversation with Artemis, and Artemis telling you know, ah, that's all right. You only need you know one team, 15, 17 games, and you qualify. No. And I was thinking, what the hell are you talking about? Like, yeah, maybe two one coaches only need 15, 17. Yes, games, you know, but... you have the perfect run. Okay, but if not, try again. Delete the team. Try again. Delete yeah. the team. Try again. All it takes, all it takes, is one muppet like to just one d your mummy into death and it just ruins your whole run. <laughs> Yeah, one of my, one of... now that the 64 is pretty easy to qualify, yeah. But you still need really a certain easy. amount of time. It's easy for you, it's not easy for me. And it's like, I mean, like, yeah, if I played 100 games, then maybe. But mm. playing 100 games isn't easy because Blood Bowl's brutal. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly, try. Like, like that, that's what I think, you know, like, okay, if die or, or try or. Or any of, yes. any of the good players, if if they had played, you know, five thousand games, or whatever Chris has played, and if they did chores every season, store, you know, then yeah, they would have done the same or better um, or worse, you know, whatever. They did, they would have won. They would have won a lot more than they've won, wouldn't they? But yeah, Chris has done it, so that's it. End of debate. Well, he's uh, not the best chorf coach. <laughs> <laughs> not the best chorf coach I've ever played. Is he not? Well, no, it's a famous, it's a famous clip from back in the day when I was a bit more full of myself. <laughs> uh, and I played Dio with Ch I was Nurgle and he was Chorfs, and I absolutely banged on him like. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I was saying, I don't think he knows what he's doing with Chorfs or that. Like, <laughs> completely oblivious to how good he was with Chorfs. <laughs> like, it's pretty funny. Yes, Dor. Yeah. All right. Very good. Very good. The not not the best team ever, the best Wood Elf team that I had ever had personally. <laughs> yeah, and as soon as it got that good, you didn't win a game. Yeah, yeah. truth to be told, people that complain about Crucifer usually people that have no idea about the uh, Blue Ball. Bruce has achieved the most in CCL, Dog to the Dog. Yeah. CCL is a completely different form. I guess he's won Blitz Pit, which again is massive. But outside of that, did he? He didn't win BBSL, did he? It was PC, uh, PC, Rick, and Davo. Yeah, and Davo's won Blitz Pit, hasn't he? Yeah, he won yes. it with High Elves. With High Elves. Wolf Barks won Chalice and Blitz Pit. It is funny, yeah. It's, it winds people up, doesn't it? <laughs> it is. It is funny. Creating more division in in Blood Bowl is great. <laughs> I just don't think anyone should get their knickers in a twist about it. Like, who cares? I, I just don't... F I, I think Chunter's, like, better than some of the people mentioned in Tier 1. Oh, who, who do you think he's better than, then? Let's go, let's go, Dimmy. Who do you think he's better than? <clears throat> no comment. Oh. I mean, you can't think he's better than Cole. No, no. K I, mean, I think Kvo K <laughs> K is number one for me. Mm. Kvo is number one. But then, like, the problem is, is I don't... I've seen Purple Goo and stuff, but I, I, I've never, like, like, because he doesn't play Blood Bowl 2 and all that, like, you just don't know, do you know what he's, I mean? You he's, don't know. He's good, yeah. I've, I've played him, he's very, very, very good. But you don't know, like, what level it is. I, like, I play Giggs, though, in, on Fumble, and, like, he's pretty good as well. Another Team England member. Mm -hmm. And, uh, I've played Store, I think Store's pretty good. Like, it's really, really hard. I say absolutely right, Sika Six. That's why I take pride in, uh, you know, being considered a shitter at the game because I don't play that much and I'm happy investing my time in other things, like talking about other people to uh, play. Uh, the one question I, the one question I really want to know is, would Dio get on Team England? Is that that is? Well, probably it would just be how much they liked him, right? That's it's just all. Is that? Do you, do you reckon that's what it boils yeah, down to? Yeah, it's all about clickiness and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... Podfrey's weird, isn't he? Because he's just about the only good player that doesn't play online. Like, good tabletop that doesn't play online. Pete W? Does he play Fumble or Plays not? Fumble, yeah. Pete W is really good. Yeah, he did good at NAF champs, didn't he? Mm. 
Mm. Mate, the two guys in the final I didn't really rate that much, to be honest. Mm. That's the thing, that's finals, right? That's that's the, just the way it goes. Like, you really, it's very unlikely you get the best two coaches in the final. In like, you know, in a, in a, in a kind of tournament like that, because there's just so much variance, isn't there? And the game was just completely spoiled. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was, it was, it was horrendous. It was typical Blood Bowl fashion, to be fair. Like, yeah. I was so disappointed with that. Imagine, I can only imagine what um, the dwarf guy was thinking. Yeah, yeah exactly, Try. Yeah, I, there you go. I, I agree with Try. Try has, Try has said it pretty much perfectly there. But I mean, he's one chalice, so, and he's yeah, he's one. So's Gasol, more. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so's Woohoo Boy. So there's plenty of good guys that haven't won it, you know. There is, there is, yeah. Some people get diced by Norse, <laughs> or fucking rats, <laughs> or woodies. <laughs> but you know like obviously in those runs I got lucky against other people as well so like that's the thing there's just a lot of luck involved right in the runs yes because there is so many games you know to yeah. qualify and then uh, play during the you know luck is going to no, be a factor Woohoo Boy, Boy didn't win Chalice because I said he won Chalice and he, he hasn't won Chalice he did he did he won with Necro won no with it's Necro. someone else no it's no. Boy. it is Woohoo Boy I'm pretty sure Woohoo Boy has never won Chalice. He absolutely has. Am I thinking? Who am I thinking of? I don't know. Have we seen the wizard here anyway? This looks like who, a wizard spot, doesn't it? Who is the guy who lost to Kfo in the final Blitz Pit after being 2 0 up with Lizards against his Pro Elves? I can't remember. I thought that was Woohoo Boy, and I said Woohoo Boy won it, and Woohoo Boy came in my chat and was like, no, I've never won Chalice. It wasn't Woohoo Boy, honestly. Why? Well, he hasn't used the wizard. Interesting. This seemed to be a little bit open to us, I think. I guess he's saving it for overtime. Yeah. Season three was Boo Hoo Boy. Okay. Yeah, there's lot. There's just loads. Of, it's just the nature of the game, isn't it? There's always going to be loads and loads and loads of luck in, involved in things. Oh, here we go. Do you shoot a play, guys? Uh, yes. Although the scatters are a bit iffy. Yeah, I thought I thought he would have I thought he would have supported it with a wizard, but I guess he just thought he didn't have to. Without luck, like, BB would lads. always be a draw. Pen, pen F, pen F. That is the biggest nonsense I've ever heard. <laughs> uh, and I, I don't know whether that was a joke because if it was a joke, <laughs> it's funny. Because that isn't a joke. I completely disagree, and I'm yeah. slightly disgusted. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. I don't know. Obviously yeah, lost in text translation and all that sort of thing. Yeah. I mean, between two good... And again, no, I disagree with that as well. He, he base cage with guard and stuff. Like, it was it was bad. It was bad. But I, but I thought he would have supported it with a wizard. But he just didn't. And... Good players make mistakes. Oh, oh, magical! Oh, he just caught it. Yep. Well, it's gonna, he's gonna score, and then it's gonna be up to Chant and score with a wizard, and then it's gonna go to overtime. It's gonna come down to who wins the toss. Mm. But I say that, and after saying GG at the other game that happened the other day that I can't spoil the result of, <laughs> I, I am, I'm very much humbled, and I will not say anything. But my prediction is overtime, and winner of the overtime toss wins the mm. game. Interesting. Um, you're allowed to hear whatever you like, PC. Yes, people people can hate anything or or dislike. But I mean, it doesn't doesn't matter. Does I it? didn't like the pylon. I like the pylon either. personally. But I hate waterboarding I goblins and then dragging them before their pets and murdering <laughs> their pets in front of them. <laughs> and you you can hear that, Dimmy. You can hear that. But but I like it. <laughs> it was pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> It was pretty funny. Stopping the Just, poor goblin 14 times as well. <laughs> Couldn't kill him. <laughs> Just stabbing him to death with a teaspoon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, Try. Exactly. Yeah, I like the pylon. I like it, but people can hate it. Like, people can hate it. That's fine, isn't it? You know? It doesn't mean that Purple Chest is shit at Blood Bowl because he hated it. 
I'm, I'm, I'm just quietly, I'm 3 0, zero versus PC, so... <laughs> just quietly, of course. <laughs> I mean, two of those games I did have a wizard, so... Are oh, wizards OP? Potentially. Yeah, anyone. Exactly. It's anyone in Chalice, right? If someone's qualified for Chalice, there's like... You know, okay, there are easier games in Chalice, like obviously the Goblins. And, well, I say that, not for Artemis. The Augurs are easy games in Chalice. But apart from that, there's no, like, proper easy games, really, are there in Chalice? And, like, everyone who's qualified is capable of beating pretty much everyone else who's uh, qualified. Amazons. Amazons, maybe. Yeah. With, uh... With... Chorfs or dwarfs or... Yeah. But do you know what I mean? Like, everyone can win. Every Pretty much everyone can win every game in Chalice. Mate, so, like, hey, Bright, it. Bright, like, single-handedly took out two of the Claw Palm teams, didn't he? Yeah, With Lizard, yeah. which was insane. That's about yeah. as bad as it gets, I think. Like, yeah. outside of the Ogres and the Goblins like, and the Halflings. Yeah. Yeah, so, like, anything can happen. Nothing means anything. <laughs> He can mighty blow chunk his best right. He probably should, but he's followed that hit. Well, he had to follow that hit. He's pushed the wrong square, hasn't he? No, oh, he's got sidestep. I don't know. No, no, he doesn't have. No, he hasn't. No, no, no. No, he's got, the the best rat's got sidestep. One, two, three, four. Gets the power. I'm not drunk. 12, oh, yeah. 11, 10, 9, 8. Oh, he's got a square of lateral movement. Okay, he's got a square of lateral movement. All right. The, the, the D and the J are pretty close on the keyboard. He's probably talking about me. <laughs> he's got a square of lateral movement. All right, I didn't count the squares. Flip me. Counting is hard. Yeah, counting is hard, all right. We're not all as clever as try. Fucking Sherlock Holmes over here. This isn't bad actually getting the score here because at least like the wizard isn't, you know, going to turn him over and lose the game for him. Oh, I'm glad you said junk because I I read that as a different word. <laughs> 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 I definitely thought you got your J and your C mixed up there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Try. Yeah. I, I wondered if I misplayed in my semi to be honest versus the rats. Rats with a wizard is horrible, isn't it? And, to be fair, the rats that I played are Nudge 6 and Nudge 5, and while I felt hard done by, it's hard to say they were that lucky. You know, like it's, they were pretty high odds to do something with a wizard in Nudge 5 and Nudge 6. The coach? Oh, it was uh, um, Malalanus, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's not like, you know, not like saying I played better or anything. Just It just felt like it was the dice and there's nothing I could have done about the steel, you know? Because he was had an edge five and an edge six and a wizard. Like how the hell? How the hell do you just stop that? It's pretty hard, isn't it? It's pretty hard to like. Oh, if I'd moved my guy in the right square, I'd have stopped the edge six guy just running through and picking it up and scoring. Yeah, yeah. the edge six just makes everything I want in thirty six. It uh, annihilates the lack uh, factor. That <laughs> HTK got denied his cargo. <laughs> <laughs> That flicky emote is probably the best emote on Twitch, honestly. It's pretty great, isn't it? Yeah. I think it is the best emote on Twitch, like in Blood Bowl community. Yeah. I like the other one that HCK has with the, the, the crazy guy going like, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty good, yeah. Chunter does not have a natty. The best he's got is Edge 5 sidestep. Leap. Hey, like I, I, I swear, Flicky needs to come in his stream character to a tabletop event and just start smashing the table <laughs> and screaming. It's my favourite player and all that. Like I would pay, like and just stream it. Like just, you know, like you know, like Sasha Baron Cohen, uh, Sasha Baron Cohen or whatever. Like when he's um. Borat. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Time, we yeah. should just we should just pay Flicky loads of money <laughs> to get him to go to a tabletop tournament and do like his Flicky impression and yeah. just like yeah, yeah, this guy, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> fucking <laughs> game, play, 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 <laughs> fucking shot. dies. You can play, you can make a TV kid, series. You know? You could play make a TV series out of it. It'd be f it'd be hilarious. <laughs> like, I would watch that like happily. You know, play, playing versus a small kid, you know, and they can flick it going mental. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's PW. Yeah, PW. Yeah, PW. This kid. <laughs> 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 this mother.
motherfucker! <laughs> 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 You're amazing. Like, how good was that <laughs> Mate, that would go viral, I swear. That would, go viral. <laughs> that would be the literal best thing ever. <laughs> you know, you know, it's weekend. The weekend has started when you get that stream of uh, Flicky screaming. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh, Blitz! And he didn't defend against it very well if it's over here and it is! Oh my god! Oof. Oh, well. I heard, oh, Chant uh... I, heard, I heard Chant a sigh there. <laughs> I heard him go. You know Chant does that sigh, doesn't he? He's got that. Yeah. Like, yeah. I heard it. I heard it in my brain. Like, so. Why didn't he have a player? Oh. He should have had another player over here. Not that it mattered too much, but he should have had another player over this side, right? Potentially. Like this guy isn't doing anything here, so he should have been over there, or somebody should have been over here. This guy should well, be more central, probably. It's tough. It's tough. There is Sorry. a chance that the IG5 uh, catcher in, ends in the square. And this, this everybody, this is why you take kick. As you can see, the kick skill for the high elves led to this, and it's it's amazing for them. It's ASDK, it's ASDK. I mean, cargo bay. That, that, that was irony from the side of uh, Jimmy Fantastic because he doesn't like a uh, kick. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Perfect. Are you being sarcastic? Are you, is this your hilarious sarcasm on display? You know what's going to happen, though, is he's going to fail to catch and it's going to be a touchback. Could be, could be one of these blitz disasters. He's got, he's got an edge five catch it to catch it. <laughs> so I mean, ones ones always fail, Jim. They do, they do. But uh, he needs to roll once twice. So it's a one in thirty six of not catching the ball. I have there. never seen a snake before in my life. Yes. Catching never. Whoa, what? What the hell? What, what are you playing at, you idiot? What, what is this? Move, move that player. Move that player, please. What the hell? What the hell, Lamaz? Oh my god. Oh, maybe Kick him out of the challenge. Because he doesn't have a... Lamaz so not tier know. one. <laughs> Lamaz not tier one. <laughs> Carry on! <laughs> because, because he's worried about no the street way. baller? Oh yeah, no bolted, way. yeah, bolted, <laughs> strip ball. Yeah, but what? Yeah, yeah. It's the problem is the problem is the the touchback, which is yes. If it's a touchback, touchback it's a complete disaster. Yeah, it's the like touchback a... is a killer. I'd be more scared of the touchback. George Michael said, "Wasn't it?" Way, way, way. But yeah, at least there's an obvious reason, I guess. Is that um, is the wizard but i think it's a wrong reason wait is this a blitz no sick as eggs uh scun uh scun uh, China scun just skipped his china just skipped his turn <laughs> <laughs> just you know they passed down you know to give a chance to of the of course it's a blitz <laughs> i mean who would do that who would just skip their turn i mean uh, come on <laughs> That uh, I mean, the reason of that's the reason of having the catcher there because you know you guaranteed it's not gonna be a touchback. He's gonna roll a six, and he's gonna roll a six. Scunta. <laughs> oh, well, he catches it, so it was the right play. Well okay, done. okay, that right play. You know we. we... <laughs> Clearly not, uh, we are not tier one here because we don't see this place. Yeah. So is this the lightning bolt? I mean, the thing is, dog to the dog, like, I, I, as I said, this guy could have been over there, but how it doesn't do a lot, right? It, it makes the blitz better and stuff, like, it makes it a tiny bit harder, but you're still, you're still in a world of pain. <laughs> I mean, if the gutter was there, that would be the gutter, would be punched in the face. It's yeah, got to so... be the lightning bolt, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Oh, he rolled the There you go. He can, he can, he can... Oh, no, 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 but he can chain the tackle onto the mighty blow and then he can blitz no through with, with the, no the root and the up. <laughs> How can he chain him, though, with blocks? He can't chain him with blocks. Oh, he's got grab. He's got grab. Yeah. Oh, wow. He could block and then he could grab and then he could chain. Oh, my God. Guy. Do you see oh, the player, guys? 
I oh, just called it, Jim. Did, did, you see the, did you see the grumpling, that, though? Exactly what I just said. Wow. Yes, literally is what he said. My God. Wow. Wow. Oh, he hasn't seen it. Has he? he hasn't oh, no, seen he the play. He hasn't seen the play, guys. Unbelievable. I mean, that was it. Was just taking his whole team, but it was it was that was a really cool idea. That Jimmy, really cool. Jimmy, Rochelle, Jimmy, 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 you didn't call using the grab to grab him back and then chain exactly. him with the Exactly, Jimmy is for you? your content, Jimmy. That's it. That was uh, Jimmy, the one that saw it, uh, the first uh, oh, place. Oh, Jimmy, God, you didn't say how he could chain him. You right. just didn't give me an opportunity. You just came in and stole my thunder. Sorry. Yes, that's what they hear. Yeah. Uh, Sorry, I don't know how many you know players that... it would have used or how 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 realistic it was. Was there, JV? Yeah, and maybe it would have, if he'd done it differently. The way he did it, if he hit this guy first, maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, I I, I agree. Try. <laughs> oh fuck! I'm leaving. Fuck <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! He really did leave. Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Sorry, Dimmy. <laughs> oh god. Oh! <laughs> oh no, I rolled a one for diplomacy. It was just a joke, Dimmy. It's just a joke. I stole your content, okay? That was a really good spot, though. It was a really good spot. Oh, no. Oh, Dimmy. Yeah. That was that was a hell of a play, wasn't it? That was a hell of a play. Chain him back, block him back, and then chain him forward. You're all monsters. Oh, thanks, Tim. You're all monsters. <laughs> Phew. God, I thought you I thought you were pissed off then. Oh, no, no, I'm not at all. I thought it was hilarious. Good. <laughs> I just had to smash my keyboard, <laughs> throw it across the room. My favourite player! <laughs> <laughs> well, now that's it, fine. Sorry, I had to take a break there because how oh, Jimmy called that uh, grab play was so good that I had to uh, take a breather. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit, find me. Find me trying to double one the diplomacy now. <laughs> Uh, what's the play here? Just run back and keep it, right? Probably. Just run back and keep it. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, you two one up. Turtle. Turtle like you've never turtled before. Don't take it off. Stand guard up, blitz, chain out, run back, everything. Or you could just uh, blitz him to free him and then suit. Dodge him off so you can hand off to the sure hands. Because having it on sure hands is pretty good, isn't it? I mean, he just needs to let the times pass, protect the ball, and that's it. Yeah. yeah, like this chain was an obvious good chain, wasn't it, to get them off? But then, yeah, you do want the ball in sure hands, to be fair. And you definitely want the edge five, like, adjacent to it, so that when you inevitably lose the ball, then the edge five might catch it. <laughs> But this should be, this should be uh, enough to defend, really. Ah, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, maybe just follow and get out of strip range. Yeah. 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 Maybe that was a shout. And then just dodge all these guys off to and screen it and everything. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was a pretty decent shout. Chunce is just at the mercy of the twos now, isn't he? Pretty much, if if elves can just roll a bunch of twos here, they're they're pretty much untouchable. 
Easier said than done, though, Jim, you know? I mean, my team couldn't fucking do it. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't get the follow-up block there, because that's a bit rubbish. Yeah, I mean, I don't like the block at all. No, I would have just... But, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. So you might, you might get some chances still, but they're going to be lower odds than you would like, aren't they? What did, what did I say at the start of this half? I've got no idea. I don't know. Yeah, 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 I said made... Lamar Soleil is favourite to win this if the wizard fails. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. That was pre that was obvious, but you were the one that said it. Yes, that's true. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was 1-1 one -one after Chunter's drive, wasn't it? So, yeah. Man, getting the blitz was disgusting, wasn't it? Like, a completely disgusting blitz with a ball like that. Like, that's so unlucky. Oh, wow, yes, he just faced him and then ran away. I might have to make my own bet, uh, Blood Bowl betting website <laughs> on Chalice Games. Yeah. I, reckon that, I reckon that might be my new thing, my new uh, motivation in life. <laughs> I, I don't read what Joe says. He's toxic. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not sold on this cage either. No, this this looks badong. Which is bad and wrong, if you don't know. There's all sorts of chains here. Do you shoot a play, guys? You can see several. It's like almost too many options. Yeah. This is where it becomes difficult because there's so many options. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. Like this is, this is a turn where you wish you had ten minutes, right? Where you wish you had your seven minutes bonus time from Blood Bowl three, because there's got to be a really cool player here. It's just whether you can see it in time or not. Yeah, I've spotted it already. The best in these players. I've spotted it already, but I'm not telling you because Jimmy will just steal it and say <laughs> it was his own. I'm not looking for it. To and be then honest. everyone in chat will be like, "Yeah, great, great play, Jimmy." Great play, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm not even looking for the play. I don't really, I don't really care about the play. <laughs> but um, I'm sure there's like some super sexy chain. There's several. Hmm. No, oh, yeah, he's mm. gone with this. Okay, this is fine, isn't it? Hmm. This is fine. This might be the best. It's, it's one of the more obvious ones. If he's doing it, which is which is grabbing this guy to here and then chaining this guard into there and then blocking there and then coming in. <laughs> oh, squirrel. Oh, he hasn't done that. Okay. Well. Now I'm a bit confused. I thought that was the point of putting that guard in, was to do that, was to do the ground. Interesting. Very interesting, Mr. Crystal Hunter. Now he has the chain with the... Uh... Oh, he's one in here, he won it. Oh, well, I was going to say he has the chain with the thrower, but... No, he has the turnover. Oh, and now it's going to be a very defended cage. Yeah, this is almost GG now. Yes, yeah, I'm going one on three, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Try. Oh, embarrassing Mr. Hunter. You roll a, you roll a 1 in 81. Yeah, no, nothing's really working when you roll a 1 in 81, is it? I think there's a part of the things haven't gone Chanter's way. I mean, get no. blitz, then fail the wizard, then uh, one in eighty-one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's an understatement to say it hasn't gone his way. Yeah, he's been, he's been comedy mega this half for sure. There is, and this is why you know winning chalice or whatever doesn't mean a whole lot, right? Because this game, this the way this half has gone does not say anything about who's the best player, does it? <laughs> you know, or who was play, even played best this game. Because like obviously like someone could be a better player than somebody, but they can still get outplayed on the day, can't they? You know, like uh, yep. Even the mighty core could play worse than, say, you know, Dio and uh, in an individual game. Um, I, mean, I had to pick someone else really good. <laughs> like he, he could play worse than somebody in an individual game, even though he, overall he's better. So, 
but I mean this is just comedy mega, isn't it? Absolute comedy mega. I don't understand this play here at all. Because I would have just wanted to um to have just made it safe. And now he's blocking that block with like the ball completely exposed. This is uh Blockless blocks. What this, is going on this here? Is pretty, I mean, this is pretty insane, right? Exposing the ball. First of all, giving yourself a 1 in 36 chance to, like, lose almost. And then exposing the ball if it works. Like, it's mad. It's a mad play from the Mars. Of course, he's got the Protecting the ball so uh, is uh, secondary here. Yeah. He's got the dice, so it was a good play. <laughs> Needs to just punch that guy and then get this guy in the way. I, I think you're being a bit harsh there, Try. I mean, this is an absolute dicing, isn't it? The the the. The the that care, that square kick. There's nothing he could, no way on earth he could have defended against that, and then, and then the one on the bolt as well. Like that's that's just absolutely horrendous. And then the one in eighty one is like. Yeah, I I mean I agree as well, but you know. I agree. Yeah, that's true. It should be it should be one one, shouldn't it? But he'd still be losing two one instead of three one, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, that's fair. That would just make getting banged out like getting banged this hard in in this half even that much more harder to take, though. <laughs> Now it's not like uh, Chante has many options left. Mm. <laughs> I mean, there is always the lib red dice. After all, the ball is in a player with wrestle. Yeah. Which is why I don't like having wrestling on the ball carrier. But I mean, it was the, the, the Blitzer also has wrestle, so. But also has block. Yep. I, I Dimi, are you still with me. us? Me in the kebab. Hey. Oh, which one of the 300 of your 300 tier one kebabs is this? It's a mixed grill, so it's chicken, uh, kofta, and lamb. Oh, good, good. Yeah, you probably should go for the red dice, yeah. Yes. I... I agree with that. That's it. Oof. Yeah, he's, he has to, like, at least he's got wrestle. Hey, I say that. Oh, sorry, Jimmy say that, you know, and I repeated it. Okay, that may be... <laughs> the wizard rolled a one quarter. A uh, very brutal one. <laughs> yep. I mean, he's two GFIs away. So I guess, I guess that's why he did this, because it gives him the chance to just win next turn, I guess. Doesn't have to defend. You could also just run back, right? You can just run away from the run away from the guy. So I guess this is good, a good spot from Chunter, because it, it's on the same level as him. Like, if he'd run back, he could run back and get away from it. So this is a pretty good... Pretty good position, like two cutters are out of the play if you can just bring it back now. Oh, should fit up. He could conceivably hit the hit the stripper with tackle and then just run all the way back, right? Well run all the way back first.
I mean, yes, try. Like, that's the obvious play just to score. But, like, he could think about running back. But I guess 2-2 two, two is pretty easy to do, isn't it? Oh. It's true, but he doesn't lose the game if he fails those twos, whereas if he rolls the two here, he probably loses the game. I can't believe he's sideline caging. That seems insane. Nah, that can't be. Well, I mean, why has he done this? So, like, this is the... Why yeah. has he done this? That's the question. And the only explanation is he's not scoring this turn. Maybe he's just cover in case he fails to like the, in case he rolls like the double one or whatever. But I mean, come on, you've just got a base, haven't you? Like you can't risk a one in thirty six on top of the two one in thirty six because you've got to do. And what he goes to here, and then you've got a bit of a screen he can come around. He's got a lot of cars. Huge player gone to the final. Yeah, so it was just to cover for the uh, the Duplay ones. Not a fast player, is he, the master there? It's been a long game. Yes, me too, game. try. Me true. Me true, me too. Yes, just move the guy down and just click and so on and finish this. <laughs> One at a time. Imagine he wasn't going to score. Maybe he wasn't going to score. Who knows? <laughs> well, there you go. Ch needs like a right or a one turn. And a blitz, I guess. Yes, one turn and a blitz is the the play here for a Yeah, I think you've got to augment the beard. Like you've yes, got to commit because, the ball. <laughs> because if you stop just there, <laughs> the rats get the ball. Oh, I mean, did well get the semi final. It's not great. It's not a great skating team, is it? It's all right. It's you know what I mean. Like it's all right, isn't it? It's got four good players instead of six, and it doesn't have a nine. So like it could be, it could be a lot better as a skating team. But it's it's not it's not bad at all. Well, he didn't have shadow in, did he? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, that was the reason. Don't think he made any uphill blocks in this match, and that's why he lost. Oh, I'll let you know, uh, Jimmy, that Potato McWhiskey, the man with probably the best uh, name on Twitch, <laughs> is also streaming Dungeons and Dragons right now. Oh, glorious. And he's going to be, I think he's using, yes, uh, uh, Roll20. Uh, mm. Yeah, Chandler needs a miracle. Yes. Don't say it's over. It's not over. Yes, quads. It made me feel real bad when, when the rats lost to the chaos. Because I would have smashed him, I thought. <laughs> I, thought I, would have, I thought I would have smashed the final against Corbyn. So, yeah. Got to be in it to win it, Jim. Exactly. I, lost. I mean, it's fair that I lost the last thing. Do you know what I mean? I've got no no hard feelings about losing to the rats. It just, it just felt not very fun or interactive because he had a wizard in Nudge 5 and a Nudge 6 and I just felt like there was nothing I could do you know to stop him stealing with the wizard but maybe I could have done you know maybe I should have gone for like an L stall and like a quick score and stuff and get back on defence because I was so much stronger than him on defence yeah so you know maybe I did play it wrong I'm 100% team Ungern mmm 
Well, it's going to be uh, it's going to be a French off, isn't it? It is, yeah. <laughs> oh la la, le bling bling bling, bring oh. out the croissants. <laughs> oh, oui, oui, oui. Vive, oui, oui. <laughs> Vive la blapo, and it means it's going to be two French winners out of three. Yeah, unbelievable. And also, uh, you know, lucky to have Dimi that's been uh, living in France uh, for a long time. Yeah, I, can, I basically know... am French. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I know. the sidestep Penef Penef. It's oh he got the riot. He's got the riot, so he can um so he so he blitzes the sidestepper with grab to put him there. Then all the squares are filled, so he pushes him to there. Wait, but then it was the, the wrong riot. Yeah, it's the wrong the riot. riot. Oh, the it was the wrong riot. riot. Oh. oh my god. Oh, I hate that. I genuinely hate that. They they fixed it in the in the new one, haven't they? They fixed it in Blood Bowl 2020. Um, well, you say fixed it. Yeah. Uh, oh my god! Oh Riot, my Riot god! is the most uh, toxic kickoff event. It is. That's, that's true. Like you do all that work to grind to a two-one win against oh, Elves, and they get a riot and just draw the game turn, or man. win the game. Mm. If you draw, no, it's I hate. I always had security gate when stadiums were in. That's a, that's I that's a reaper of it. There is a. Probably this riot has been one of the most brutal things yeah. I've seen in the chalice when it comes to kickoff events. You know, well, that, was, that, was just the, that was just the cherry on the top. So you got the blitz, <laughs> the failed wizard, and then the, the reverse riot. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was, uh, yeah. Wow. Adversity yeah, reigns. Uh, oof. Yeesh. Adversity reigns. Yeah, that was that was brutal, wasn't it? Unbelievable, unbelievable, like second half. But yeah, you've got to say, you've got to say that it was it was the kind of, you know, the allowing in the two turn. You know, he could have he could have done more to uh, prevent that. But yeah, obviously he was diced to death in the second half. Um, so there you go. Yeah, I got the prediction wrong. I did predict, I did predict Chunts winning. Um, and he didn't really get a lot of damage at all, did he? He, he did make two deaths, but he didn't make a lot of AV breaks for Claw Pump. Every semi final, the second half has been absolutely mental. Yeah. The other semi final, the second half was also mental too. It really was, yes. Yeah. So there you go. Congratulations, Lamassole. Tri's favourite coach. Commiserations, Chunter. Thank you very much, Fimir and Dimi. Absolutely glorious commentary. As always, a pleasure to be here. Amazons will never win, Chalice. There you go. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>